Oh, nobody will ever be that good again. Shaq will never be as good as Will. Okay. <laughs> Shaq would dominate Will in his prime. I mean, that's, it's, it's totally, I mean, it's just ignorant to think otherwise. I mean, I, I like, I'd say Kobe is probably the best Laker of all time. Uh, you got to put Kareem in there. All-time leading scorer. Um, boy, Jerry West is the logo. I mean, it's, it's a really, that's a really, really tough question. Hell, I think Wilt even played for the Lakers, right? Wilt was a Laker for a little bit. I mean, Shaq had his best years in L.A. I mean, hard to argue with any of these guys, but I like Kobe. I, it's, Strictly because I think he's the second best player ever. Right behind Mike. I don't know. That's a good question, though. I mean, it's... I There's... With some teams, you know, it's just the list goes on and on. And, it, and it's hard to really narrow one down, but that's a good question. Uh, Mike Pendleton in the chat room. I want to talk about this. Because I've been wanting for a while, as you guys know, I talk about it a little bit on here to kind of expand or extend my website a little bit just get a more tra a little more traffic going through here and kind of open it up to uh, you know to, to anyone anyone who might want to do a show and uh, and my friend Mike here found me a couple months ago on Ustream and has been listening ever since told me he wanted to do a show that's what he wanted to do with his self so I said hey man just do a show on my website so now it's happening. Mic'd Up is officially on ericpedigo.com every Tuesday and Thursday. And um, I got to say, it's it's been a hit so far. The kid gets a ton of people listening. I mean, a ton of people. But yeah, power, man. I was hoping you still wanted to do a show. Yeah, just uh, send me an email. Find me on Facebook. I'm easy to find if you're on Facebook. Um, yeah, we'll friend up. And, uh, and we'll get you set up too, man. I also, uh, let me talk a little bit about Mike's show. I, I've, I've listened to it, and he does a good job. He does, I mean, it, it, he's got potential. He knows what he's talking about. So, uh, you know, I urge you to check it out. Tuesday, Thursday nights, typically around 8, 830, right in there. But he works, so it kind of varies. But still every Tuesday and Thursday. And uh, yeah, let's see, last night he was on, I know it was Monday, but he did his show a night early. I'm doing my show a night early. Uh, he had a couple guys on from his football team. His high school's football team, I think, is undefeated. And uh, it was a big show. A ton of people came through and, and listened and checked it out. And I mean, that's, that's what I was telling you today. Man, this is prime time to get started. You are in high school. And it, the, the, the word just spreads when you're in high school. Like right now... I'm trying to get people that I went to high school with, you know, to even know. I still they they run into me like, "What are you doing?" I'm like, "Well, I do a show, you know, on the internet." And they're "What? You're on the Redo Radio?" Yeah, yeah, I do a show on the internet. I do. I'm on 1450 a little bit, and everybody nobody knows. But in high school, I mean, it's ideal, man. Not undefeated. Oh, my bad. I thought okay, but you're six seed in class seven A. Oh, nice, nice. I thought you guys were undefeated. Either way, you, you had a really good season, right? I mean, six seed in Class 7A is, is remarkable. It's a big school. So, anyhow, Mike show is doing really well. You know, all the kids from his high school are tuning in and listening, and every time he goes on, there's over 100 people uh, at one point or another stop by to check it out. So, uh, you know, keep it up, Mike. You're doing a good job. Everybody... Stop by and listen. Support him a little bit, if you will. Elwood, Elwood's always there. He's a supporter. And also, Elwood, I, I want to bring this up. I talked to your buddy, D. Tong, and I'm happy to announce that we'll be getting another new show on ericpedigo.com. Uh, Dan Tong is his name. I think he's from uh, Colorado somewhere. Denver, maybe. He does a show on Blog Talk Radio. Elwood set me up with him. Uh, it's... Georgia, okay, his thing said, like, Colorado, his Facebook said Colorado. Um, he does a show on Blog Talk Radio, and it's it's a sports talk show, but he also blends in music. It's a little unconventional, but I like it. At first, I was a little, I was a little sketchy, I didn't know. He was telling me, uh, you know, um, like, 
you know, Elwood was telling me, well, he does a show, and it's like half music and half sports, and I was like, huh? But I checked it out, and I listened to it, and I like it. I mean, I, I like it. I like the format, and I like the songs he was playing, too. You know, so I sent him a message like, hey, man, I, you know, I dig your show. Elwood's been telling me about you. Um, okay, the power says there are six Eric Pettigos on there. Uh, mine, my Eric Pettigo should be the first one, and it's my kid riding a horse. Yeah, it's my son on a horse. So if you see a little kid on a horse, that's me. Should be the first one. I'm easily the most popular. Mike, I'm not, I'm not, okay, I might be the oldest one. I don't know. <laughs> might be. But that, that's me. Yep, send, send me a request on over. We'll friend up. We'll hash it out. Oh, man. So, yeah, d going to be starting a show. And I think he said, he sent me a message. He, he said he, he does a show usually on Fridays or Saturdays. So we'll be starting that pretty soon, too. I'm just, you know, just excited, man. I, I'm excited. I, getting shows going on here now. Power says he's going to do a show. I want to get shows every night, you know, during the week. Just a bunch of shows. A bunch of sports shows. And and I really, you know, I don't want to put any limits on what, any, what anybody can do. Like Mike, I think, you know, there are probably some... I'm going to have to put a disclaimer on before your show if you have those two chuckleheads in that you had last night with, the, <laughs> with their sailor potty mouths. But it is what it is. You know what I mean? It's cool. I, you, you guys do whatever kind of show you want. I don't care. <laughs> Mike says he thinks I have a chance to take Charles Barkley's spot on TNT. <laughs> Me and Charles are like twins? Shut up. <laughs> uh, okay. Power sent me a request, and his name is John. Oh, sorry, man. I don't know. If Anyhow. I don't got it yet. I'm sure it'll show up pretty soon. All right. Well, I'm excited. So we're going to get some shows going on here. Not bad at all. Um, 